One of my goals for 2021 is to post at least 100 videos by the end of the year. That's a lot of videos, like that's at least two videos a week. Fortunately, I'm partnering with Intel and Asus. Yes, they are sponsoring this video because today we'll be checking out the Asus ROG Zephyrus Duo 15, an awesome PC gaming laptop, and we're gonna see if it can handle editing 4K, 10-bit, 422 video. It's also pretty, so pretty. Why a PC gaming computer to edit 4K video? Well, if you think about it, it totally makes sense. Like to play games and to stream, you obviously have to have a powerful computer. Same thing if you wanna edit 4K video smoothly. And the Asus ROG Zephyrus Duo 15 kinda seems like the ideal machine to do both. I mean, inside you got the 10th gen Intel Core i9 processor, also features the Nvidia GeForce RTX 2080 Super with Max-Q design. I mean, these are things that you look for in a video editing machine. So later in this video, we're gonna open up a project in Premiere Pro, and we're gonna see what playback is like playing 4K video at full resolution, even see what playback is like after adding LUTs, effects, and all that good stuff. We're gonna see how fast this computer exports a 4K video and really just see the overall user experience editing 4K video. But before we get to that, let's go ahead and talk a little bit more about the Asus ROG Zephyrus Duo 15. All right, so right off the bat, this computer has a sleek and slim design. When you open up the computer, you'll notice right away that the secondary screen pops up, and really it's meant to help you multitask in whatever you're doing. The secondary companion screen is like super helpful, especially if you wanna improve your workflow no matter what you're doing. So if you're gaming, you can use the secondary screen to manage your chats. If you're checking your emails or doing your homework, you can watch a YouTube video on the secondary screen, although that's, that's called procrastination. The screen is actually a touch screen, so that's cool. You can customize it, and it's actually kind of helpful when you're editing videos in Premiere. Pro. Like you can move whatever panels you want on the secondary screen and then maximize your timeline and source monitors on the main screen. So for a video editor, it's pretty cool to have that secondary screen. And under that, there are fans. There are fans underneath the secondary screen so that it brings in cooler air and cools down the laptop if you're like running this computer really hard. You also got a pretty sweet RGB keyboard. You got a cool touchpad. And if you press and hold on the top corner of the touchpad, it activates the numeric pad. So that's kind of nice. As far as ports and connectivity goes, on the left side, you have your head phone jack, your mic jack. You also got your charging port over here. And on the right side, it has two USB-A ports, a USB-C port. And on the back, it has an HDMI port, a USB-A port, and ethernet connectivity. But overall, it has a really cool, unique design. And when you close the laptop screen, that secondary screen kind of just folds in on itself. Look at that. So those are the general specs of the computer. Pretty awesome so far. But let's go ahead and see what it's like to edit 4K video on this computer. All right, so now I just opened up a project in Premiere Pro and uh, nothing is really rendered out, and uh, I'm gonna play it back at full resolution, and let's just see what happens, shall we? All right, here we go. This already is a completed project, so all the LUTs, effects, adjustment layers, everything is applied to all the video clips. We're gonna play it back for the first time ever and see how smooth the playback is. Here we go. All right, buckle up, my nerds, because today we're gonna talk about the Sony A7S III. Yes, this is my official full review. Let's go. Okay. That was smooth. That was really smooth. That was full resolution, 4K, 10-bit, 422 video, and no lag at all. Okay. All right, let's continue. Very cool. All right, so it was a little laggy at first, but after a little bit, it just, it played back smoothly and that never happens. Like, especially in Premiere Pro, I've never played back video of that smooth before. But for the most part, like to play back full res 4K 10-bit 422 video with LUTs and effects applied, like that is really, really impressive. You know how people say PCs are just more powerful machines to edit videos? Okay, I believe you. All right, so this is a pretty heavy project. This is a, uh, oh, what is it? This is a 15 minute project, almost 16 minute project. So now I'm going to try to export this video and time it to see how fast it exports. All right, here we go. All right, this is gonna be fun. All right, so that took about 10 minutes, 10 minutes to export a 15 minute 4K video file with all the LUTs, effects, and all that good stuff. All 
Anyway, so this is a smaller video project. It's about, uh, well, how long is it? It's about, okay, so uh, just under six minutes. I'm going to export this and see how long it takes to export a five minute 4K video. All right, here we go in three, two, one, export. Cool, so that was impressive. Not as fast as I'd hoped it would be, to be honest, but definitely much faster than my other computer, which makes this computer the better computer to edit 4K video. Good job, Intel. Good job, Asus, or Asus. Is it Asus or Asus? Huge thanks to Intel and Asus for sponsoring this video. And if you wanna check out the Asus ROG Zephyrus 2015, then the link will be down below. All right guys, I'm out of here, but thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. Thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit the bell so that you get notified for upcoming videos and I will see you in the next one. Bye.